Welcome back everybody to another episode of Retro Revival, where we try and bring classic games back to life. In today's episode, we're going to do an easy one. We're going to set up the original Call of Duty so that it runs at a native resolution. Step 1, install Call of Duty. You can purchase the original Call of Duty for $20 if you want it now, but that price is absolutely insane considering the game released back in 2003, so you're better off waiting for a deal. Once you have it, install the game and keep note of the save location. Step 2, edit config.cfg. Find your config.cfg file in the game's directory. Search for SATA R custom width and set that number to your monitor's resolution width, 1920 for example. You should see the height right below that, so go ahead and adjust that value to your monitor's resolution height. Next we can adjust the FOV. This is optional, but if you prefer a wide field of view, go ahead and search for CG FOV and change this value to something like 96. Next, search for SATA R mode and change that value to negative 1. This will force the game to use your inputted resolution rather than the in-game setting. Make sure that when you're in-game, you're not adjusting the resolution setting. And finally, since the game's opening intros don't play at these resolutions, we can go ahead and disable them entirely. Search for COM intro played and set that value to 1. Okay, so you're all set, so let's just do a quick summary, install Call of Duty, and edit the config.cfg. So there's not really much to this. Now when you boot up Call of Duty, it should load straight to the main menu and be at a native resolution. The only downside I've found to this game is that when you record footage with Shadowplay, the footage comes out darker than it appeared, but the actual gameplay looks and plays just fine. If you have any suggestions, feel free to let me know, but in the meantime, I hope this video was helpful, and be sure to like and subscribe for more Retro Revival.